Oh boy. They are really going to be uh, feeling the humidity out there, um, and we're going to feel it too. Certainly not as much as we will, uh, as they will actually. Mira Mesa, good morning too. 63, Vista 63, a lot of uh, low to mid 60s for our most populated coasts in our valley communities. We've got even some 70s up in the mountains and 80s right now for the desert. As we get more light out here, we're expecting some cloud cover uh, right along the coast. Uh, patchy, if anything, right along the inland valleys and even some high clouds for our mountains and our deserts. Now we look here in Northern California. We're still seeing some excessive heat warnings through the Central Valley, even down here for our mountains and deserts around 8 p.m. tonight because they'll still be slightly above average. We're not expecting to break any records, though, because of this area of high pressure that's still in place. What's happening today now is we're starting to scoop up a little bit of, of that subtropical moisture here at monsoon time, and so that's where we're going to get some mid to high level clouds and also the feeling of humidity. Now that area of high pressure is actually blocking what is tropical storm Delilah right now, which is about 45 miles per hour in strength and gusting about 52. And as it moves along, that high pressure will keep it away from the coast and still, though, it's going to produce some clouds right along the coastal areas if you've got a vacation plan this week and uh, some rain, rain at times. OK, so come back here at Home Coast 7 day forecast. Here's how the rest of the week plays out. Look, 70s for us. More average Thursday, July 4, 72 degrees. The inland valleys here. Here's where we'll go. We're seeing more widespread 80s instead of hot, hot 90s.